So what I'm asking you to do is to get your shift together. Okay, notice what I said, get your shift together. In other words, when you wake up in the morning, rather than focusing on what isn't working and all the things that need to be done and boggling up your brain, I want you in those few moments, before you take, even take the covers off, I want you to allow yourself to shift your focus and your way of thinking to the things that are working, to the things that bring you joy, to the thing that lifts your spirit, to the things that gradually make you feel better. What I'm asking you to do here, folks, in those few moments, this only takes 30 seconds to a minute to do. If you do it for three weeks, every morning, you will have created a totally different habit. And all I'm asking you to do is to create an attitude of gratitude or an attitude of appreciation. And it doesn't matter who or what it is. Think of your loved ones. Maybe as soon as you open up your eyes, you're thinking of the person lying next to you. Maybe you're thinking of your children. Maybe you're thinking of your grandchildren, the dog lying by the side of the bed. Maybe you're noticing the sun rising through your window and you're appreciating that beautiful scene. Maybe you're having people over for company on a Saturday evening for dinner. Maybe you're watching a sporting event on Sunday or you're going on vacation somewhere. Maybe somebody did something nice for you or you did something nice for somebody. It doesn't matter who or what it is. Everyone in this room can think of something that they're grateful for, that they appreciate. And what I'm asking you to do in those few moments is to hold on to that stuff and let it build. Notice how you start feeling. Now, why do I want you to do this? Because an attitude of gratitude simply makes you feel good. And what is feeling good? It's the fuel that drives motivation and inspiration. We go through the course of our lives and we allow people, situations, circumstances, and events to literally, literally suck the energy right out of us. That's because we don't know that we have these innate common sense success strategies within, within us that could meet these challenges head on.